Hello everyone, welcome in my channel ASP.NET Core and today I am going to show you the difference between ASP.NET Core and .NET Core. So what is the difference between ASP.NET Core and .NET Core? That is, uh, that is the video of today. Uh, so uh, first one is the collection of libraries. Just discuss about the ASP.NET Core. ASP.NET Core is a collection of libraries that build a web framework. Okay. And uh, this framework is used to create a website and web apps, including mobile apps and IoT apps like that. Okay. But uh, if you know about the uh, .NET Core, .NET Core is a runtime which executes the application that are built for it. Okay. It's a runtime. And the next one is um, ASP.NET Core 1.x and 2.x is actually um, um, uh, core. We used to both .NET Core and the .NET Framework. This also means that the ASP.NET Core application is also a .NET Core application or a .NET Framework application if both applications are built in .NET Core, uh, .NET Core 1.x and 2.x. But if application built in um, ASP.NET Core 3.x, that framework no longer be used .NET, uh, .NET Framework. If application built in uh, ASP.NET Core 3.x, that no longer be used on .NET Framework. Okay. But 1.x and 2.x use both .NET Core and as well as .NET Framework. Okay, that, that is the older version, you know that, uh, of the um, .NET. And if we discuss about uh, open source and the cross-platform, I mean to say that you can work, work on Windows, Linux, Mac OS. So in ASP.NET Core, open source and cross-platform and also .NET Core is open source and cross-platform. So there is that similarities between both. And the next one is .NET Core Runtime and SDK. So .NET Core Runtime and SDK include ASP.NET Core libraries. Nothing more that this is required. Okay, ASP.NET Core Runtime and SDK. Okay, but um, you will require to install .NET Core SDK to build application and .NET Core Runtime run applications. That is, okay, and if we uh, discuss about the latest version, the latest version of in uh, is ASP.NET Core is that is a 5.0, ASP.NET Core 5.0, which was released on November to, uh, 2020. ASP.NET Core 5.0 based on the .NET 5.0, but uh, retain the name Core to avoid confusion with ASP.NET MVC 5.0. So you can see that ASP.NET, ASP.NET MVC 5. That is the ASP.NET Core 5.0. That is a core uh, word is uh, removed. And the .NET Core is la the latest version in 5.0, which drops core from its name and it's a simply known as .NET 5.0. Okay, so these are the difference between .NET Core and .NET Core framework. Okay, so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to ASP.NET Core.